I did it. I finally, finally did it. So, after looking for it, for a good price, of course, um, I finally have achieved the one grail I've literally been looking for, as I say, for a good price, one where it's not going to cost me a, you know, bloody fortune. I have achieved my grail. Um, and of course, if you've watched, you know what it is. If you haven't been watching, well, that's fine. And if you're new, go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and like that like button if you choose. But I've finally done it. And I'm slowly picking away at it here now to take it out of its package. And I'm so friggin' glad that this has decided to come out on a reissue. This is not OG, by the way. I wasn't looking for OG because I wasn't paying OG, I'll tell you that. And for the heck of it, you know, because why not? Nope, that's not it. One sec. No, one sec, one sec, one sec. To go along with this fella, I have finally got this. Left Hand Path by Intuned. Ooh, baby. The moment when I walked into the store today to pick this up, I could just feel it. Like, I could, you know, like when you get to that point when you're like, you know, something good's coming and it's just like, this is going to rule. Like, this is absolutely going to rule hard. Yeah, as, a, as any of you guys who've ever, you know, who bought this record, you know. Rest in peace to that man right there, LG Lars, Lars Goran Petrov. Now, I didn't get any sort of pick or choose of the color. I just got the black vinyl. Of course, as you guys know, the uh, side one with title track, Left Hand Path and Drowned, Rebel and Flesh, When Life is Sea, Supposed to Rot. And then you got side two, which is But Life Goes On, Bitter Loss, Morbid Devourment, uh, Abnormally de Deceased, and The Truth Beyond. Of course, this is a part of the full dynamic range that Earache has released. I had half thought about going and getting um, the blue one from Earache, but I think what I might do is I might actually, like later on, I might actually see if I can get the, the CD. Um, I know a friend of mine who has the cassette, and I offered him a few a few bucks to get that cassette, and that way I could have the cassette, the CD, and of course, this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful slab of wax. This is important to me because as a fan of Swedish death metal, if you're going to have, you know, if you're going to have any two, these are the two right here. Okay, these... These are the two records to have, as far as I'm concerned. Um, I can now say I have them back to back. You know. Just pure, you know, Dan Seagrave artwork. And even it even says here on the on the uh, on the stone, 
Rest in festering slime. Here burns the souls of a thousand generations. Join the club. Dan, 19, uh, Dan, 90, Chairman. Just one of the best album covers ever, as far as I'm concerned, in fucking heavy metal. Period. One of the best. If I can officially say, Entombed has entered the chat, as it were. I call the cool kids say, and so on and so forth. Speaking of chat, um, the fellas in uh, Contact and Blood will be doing a uh, their stream tonight. I'm looking very forward to that. I haven't uh, been able to watch a full stream live. I was only there for half of one, but that's because I was, it was on my daughter's birthday and I wanted to spend a little bit of time with her, you know, at, uh, at, at her aunt's place, that kind of thing. And, and then I tuned in after, um, so they're going to be doing their, you know, the top five thrash debuts of all time. Um, obviously I'm, I, I don't, I'm, you know, I'm not a part of the, obviously, uh, a part of Contact and Blood. There's four of them. It's Scott uh, from the Rock Scout, um, Mark G with a C, uh, Metal Mickey or Mike Allen, and um, Cloudy Milder, uh, Andy. Um, I mean, I guess when it comes down to thrash debuts, I mean, you know, some people will pick, you know, Kill them all. Some people will pick, you know, killing is my business and business is good. Some people will say, you know, fistful of metal or show no mercy. I personally, and I'm going to obviously combat this as well. As far as I'm concerned, thrash, like, one of the best thrash debuts out there, and unfortunately, I do not own it because it's a f bloody fortune on uh, online. Is um, Exodus is bonded by blood. Now I know I wasn't over overly favorable of said record um, in my rankings, but you know, it's still the it's still the classic. It's still a massive, massive record. Um, very influential to many bands, but. Uh, yeah, so essentially, I'll be watching that this evening, and I and I want to pose a question to all my 140 subscribers. If you're watching, the reviews for the for the indie bands is dried up, except for one. I've got one coming. Um, I just I need to fiddle with a thing or two, and then I'll be ready to go, but, um, it's dried up, but then again, I'm not on Facebook, uh, I deact, well, I am, my messenger is still there, I deactivated my account, um, I just feel that collectively that's hurting my head, so I'm done with it, so I'm not getting as many messages, what would you guys like to see me do on my channel, would you like to see me, you know, review older records would you like to see me review new records would you like to see me uh you know what would you like to see me do going further with my channel now i do know that it's going to be harder over the next little bit because of the fact that i'm going to be spending a lot more time writing lyrics and and so on and getting other songs ready for my new band but that's besides the point um is, is there any new things, any new records you guys want me to talk about? Is there any ba new bands you want me to talk about? New bands to check out? That would be great. Like, I'm always down for that. But if you're not subscribed to me, let me know. You know, subscribe to me uh, if you choose. Um, I'm not forcing anybody to subscribe, obviously. But if you're watching and you're one of the several percent that doesn't subscribe, check it out, you know. I do realize that some of my older videos may have kind of made some people mad. 
you know, I did those out of reactional things. And of course, when people react to certain things, sometimes you get a little bit of heat and so on. But, um, you know, check out my other videos. If you don't, you don't have to check those ones out. It's not mandatory. But if there's something that you'd like me to review, like if, you, if there's other things you want me to talk about, let me know. I, I'd, I'd, I'd love to get people's input on this stuff. But I can't, you know, I obviously can't, you know, give you those, give you that kind of content if, if, if no one's making any attempt to, to, to discuss things. And that's hard because, you know, I only get a few commenters here and there and it, it can be a little frustrating, but, uh, regardless, let's get things going. And, um, other than that, thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, I appreciate it. I appreciate everybody who watches every single one of you. It doesn't matter. Um, let me know. Let me know what you guys want me to do. If you guys want me to review older records, I can do that. If you guys want me to talk about, you know, record uh, record stores and online buying or anything like that, go ahead. Um, it'd be great to talk to everybody and get some different kind of content. Cheers, guys. And make sure you check out Contact and Blood. See ya.